the C1. On to getaway. Amen, 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 amen. Two things the Hendry loves, pinball and cars. And this combines them. Oh, not just that, but this one's really special for me at the heart. And let me tell you why. As a wee lad, at like when I was like, shit, I don't know, three maybe? <laughs> Three, I guess, four, two, somewhere between two and four. I remember up in Helen, Georgia, there was a little amusement park. It was kind of crappy, but it was fun. I, I don't think it's still there. There's a tornado that went through there once and it like made it get demolished or something. And so, yeah, uh, this game was the very first pinball machine I ever played up in Helen and I love it for you that fell, you fell in love with it the nostalgic that you know for years I never knew what it was I just remembered what it looked like <laughs> and you know one day I saw a picture of the getaway up close and I was like oh my god that's the one holy crap that's, that, that that's the it. game I played that is it I gotta get it and well I don't I kind of have it but not really I'll get to okay. that in a moment the Getaway is the sequel to the classic High Speed, and High Speed is a game that is really, really good for me. And uh, sorry for the the stuttering there. Uh, freaking Bixby just it's pulled up Bixby. on my phone, and that's enough about Bixby. You should you should have a Siri. Siri uh, I'll awesome. take Bixby anyway. Uh, yeah, The Getaway came out in the mid-90s by Steve Ritchie. I think it was 1992. Uh, it's got a cool feature where there's, like, a supercharger with a blower, like you see on the hot rod. And, essentially, the idea behind this is the following, and here it is. Here we are. You shoot the ball up the ramp, and it spins around in, like... 10 circles and it goes fast and for my fellow ADHD people you're gonna have a blast let's just put it that way I, I could watch that for hours <laughs> and another cool thing is that this game has a gear shift lever instead of a plunger why here's why what you have here is you hit some targets and it increases the revs like you hit the gas pedal and your revs go up in your car. And just like in a regular manual transmission car, you shift gears when the RPMs go high enough. Same thing here. It simulates that. And as you score points and you hit targets, the RPMs increase. And Eventually, it gets up to a, the red line, like in a real car, and you shift gears, and each time you shift gears, it progresses to, like, it gives you a bonus or something. Then when you get to whatever the top gear is in the, the theoretical car, you get to red line mania! I honestly don't know what happens there. I haven't played the getaway enough, but... Uh, it's a good game. I would love to own one someday. Uh, I can't really afford one right now, or, well, I might could, but I'd have to trade things around, probably. Who knows? Maybe I'll end up buying one. But for now, I have the original High Speed, which is very similar. It's almost the same playfield layout, and it's equally cool. I love them both. I'll give this game an A out of A. How about you, Slam? A out of A, no A plus. A plus exists. Oh, well, A plus out of A plus then. Oh, well, then okay. <laughs> so, with me, I don't know. It's. Cars probably cars. ruined it for you. No, cars did not ruin it for me. I like cars. I just don't obsess about it in my dreams like you do. But, anyway. I mean, it's, it's, it's interesting, to say the least. I mean, you, you got the, uh, the, the swooping, you got the. It didn't like, uh, like we're about what we're going to get into. It didn't, uh, the ball just didn't go straight down and where you couldn't like hit it, which is a bonus for me. The gameplay was pretty good. I got a pretty good, uh, I got a pretty good, got a pretty good gameplay out of it. I, 
I enjoyed it. I'll give it, eh, I mean, I'll give it a B plus just because there was a Oh yeah. man, oh man, oh man, Amy. I mean, that's, mm. yeah. As I, I, I at least give it an A minus. So I would give it a fair five B plus. There, there's there's a pinball machine that we're gonna get into that I will give a very low grade to. But anyway, a very this, low grade to, huh? Yeah, this this one didn't have a lot of hot women on there, which I like. <laughs> but, what? Yeah, I like I like the the hot women on the artwork. But anyway, true, true. That's never a bad it, thing. Yeah, I mean it's just like it's just you know. Cars. You would have liked Flash. Yeah, I would have had a flash. hot girl in the back glass. Yeah.